Alright, look, what are we gonna be doing today? We're playing Black Ops for the first time in three years, and we're gonna be team dash, and grinding, and letting the noobs get and kills and all that stuff, and I'm gonna pee myself. For the first time in three years, pretty much like six months because I uploaded Black Ops 3 to this channel before, we're playing Black Ops 3. I think this could be a good series where we go back and play all the old CODs. I feel like you could do it with a lot of games, too. It could be a good way to, like, broaden your channel. The only bad thing about coming back to games like this, like, years after, is the sweats are still here. <laughs> yeah, you can definitely tell what kids don't take a break from this game. Like, their parents never bought you them World War II. <laughs> kids probably, like, like, wake up in the morning, greasy hair, Cheeto dust on their mouth, they're like, ah, gotta play BO3. This, this is not a game to play right after you get done a quick little CS match. But how do you build, though? That's a real question. Like, I keep pulling up, like, the, the build menu, but the triangle and, like, the stairs are just not popping up. <laughs> Oh my god, I just choked a triple because I didn't have any ammo left. What's up, though? Tuna Tartar Gang. Yeah, just steal both my kills. I didn't want any of them. Raps are honestly like one of the most overpowered score streaks of all time. Besides, like anything in Modern Warfare 2. I'm telling you, Tuna Tartar is going to be on a dad hat one day. It comes with a complimentary can of Tunner. <laughs> Tuna Tartar. Wait, hold on. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a live rare supply drop opening. All right, let's see what we get. Ah, I got nothing. We're running five mans in 2018. All right, guys. So all the good players off here, so we can finally run our team deathmatch five mans. <laughs> Mechanized infantry. Tip of the spear. Mechanized infantry. Tip of the spear. Speaking of top listy, top listers, what is your top three cods <laughs> of all time? For me, BO3 is probably like my number one, my favorite, just because I just really liked it, enjoyed it. Number two, probably gonna have to go like Modern Warfare 2, because it's just like the nostalgia of just like hopping on with your friends and just intervention in private match. But then number three probably has to be Modern Warfare Remastered, because like that game was beautiful when it came out. Number three being MW3. Number two being Black Ops 3. That's just because I didn't really grind MW3. I'm sure if I grinded MW3 as hard as I grinded MW, as hard as I grinded BO3, then it would definitely be over it. But number one. No question, Black Ops 2. We got a flashback to SD funny moments. You have a jetpack, use it. At the time, I thought that was like one of my best videos, and I look back at it, and it's garbage. Yeah, and you had the ear rate transition that like made my ears bleed. This. What? I walked right by this, by this guy, and he waited three seconds to shoot me. Like, how's it fun to be like, all right, bro, this game doesn't mean anything anymore. Nobody uploads it. <laughs> Let's sit in the corner and go for nukes. <laughs> Just slicing the lunch. door, slicing down the door frame. I'm going with the Argoose, baby. The Argoose has a uh, dark matter on too, and it has a like, Pikachu. <laughs> I still have this. Or the Pokeball? Yeah, I have the Pokeball artwork on it. Oh my god, this thing still shred sauces. I like how like you can tell by the names of like like their gamer tag what kids are going through that middle school phase where like they have to have the toughest names out there, like blood spill. Or it's like killer XX24. If anyone has dark matter or hero gear of, of any sort, they know their struggle of getting the double kills with glitch. You had the it had to be like within like a half second too. That guy would literally not die. I shot him a hundred times. Gosh, I'm so good at this game! Literally, Man, the only reason this game worked is because Treyarch made it. Like, if any other developer tried to do what they did, it wouldn't even be good. This dude was waiting at the staircase for someone to come down with his sight. He just stood there. What? Scumbags, I tell you. Favorite gun in this game can be DLC or not. M8A17. MX Grand. Dude, I used to hate that gun so much until I got it, and I'm like, dude, it's ridiculous. I remember before, like, the DLC maps came out, that this was literally, like, the yeah, only God. map that was... <laughs> That was picked in free for all. I keep forgetting that you can like one knife because all the games that I play are extremely tactical and realistic where I don't play them. This is honestly probably one of the best maps in COD history. It's like one of those classic maps that you'll always remember. Like you always hate, but you always love because you can always pop off on them. And especially since like the zombies was so good, made it so well-rounded. This game looks very good for like this time, I guess. Looks like it'd be like a year old or something right now. And the way it plays and how many people are playing it. They know it's a good game. Also like how they went on like a huge swing for the specialist. I think this should be like, like exclusive like to this game. Like it was innovative. Don't you don't need to bring it back to another game. It can stay where it is. It fits perfectly like well. Like how, yeah, like I like how B4 the like made the specialist more like it's kinda of like a rainbow six siege, like and they made the game like more like that. Oh, uh, do you remember the black cell? That was actually like one of the most enjoyable weapons to like get gold. Because you could just it's so satisfied just shooting down sweatsters.
Can we all get an F in the chat for boy snail brown? Grinded all summer, still didn't get dank matter. Ooh, nothing like finishing at the top once more. Now this is what they need to bring back. Watch, if I can't dab in Black Ops 4. All right, final thoughts before we say goodbye to BA3 before Black Ops 4 takes it over. I feel like it's one of those memorable games that like, even though like newer games will come out, people will still like play it. Even though it won't be as much, people will still play it. A lot of time sunk into this game. Nine days, seven hours, one minute and eight seconds. I have nine days, 19 hours and nine minutes. And then zombies, I have four days, 16 hours. And then campaign, campaign, I have 10 hours. So yeah, let's just pop in the video, guys. If you enjoyed, make sure to drop a like. And this is probably the final video that I'll ever make on Black Ops 3 multiplayer. So many memories, so much time sunk into this game. But I'm so excited for Black Ops 4 to come out. And yeah, if you enjoyed, make sure to drop a like. And I'll see you in another video very, very soon. Later. I'll be going way too often Wish I wasn't chosen Running from my yeomans I've been on the east side That's where I've been